You're watching From the Heart with John Willard. Hi friends, John Willard here, the Gentleman Poet. Great show and a great poem because these Ozarks are showing flowers and birds and all that Ozark beauty this very morning. And remember the subscribe button below for CNA TV, cause CNAs matter. Friends, if we are true to our own natures, we must be up and doing in the present. Time is short and mastery in any field of human activity is so long a process that it forbids us to waste our moments. Yet, we must learn also how to wait and endure. In short, we must not become slaves to either indifference or impatience but must make it our business to play a man's part in life. Let me share. Tell me not in mournful numbers, life is but an empty dream. For the soul is dead that slumbers, and things are not what they seem. Life is real, life is earnest, and the grave is not the goal. Dust thou art to dust returnest, was not spoken of the soul. Art is long and time is fleeing, and our hearts, though stout and brave, still like muffled drums are beating Funeral marches to the grave. Lives of great men all remind us we can make our lives sublime and departing leave behind us footprints on the sands of time. Footprints that perhaps another sailing o'er life's Solemn main, a forlorn and shipwrecked brother, seeing shall take heart again. Let us then be up and doing with a heart for any fate, still achieving, still pursuing. Learn to labor and to wait. What most people want, young or old, is not merely security or comfort or luxury, although they are glad to have these. Most of all, they want meaning in their lives. If our era and our culture and our leaders do not or cannot offer great meanings, great objectives, great convictions, then people will settle for shallow and trivial substitutes. This is a deficiency for which we all bear a responsibility. This is the challenge of our times. Life is like a 10-speed bike. Most of us have gears we never use. There are two things to aim at in life. First, to get what you want. And after that, to enjoy it. Only the wisest people achieve the second. That's the way we live our lives. You can't win them all. But I know people 
who are still flagellating themselves over mistakes they made 20 years ago. <laughs> they say, I should have done this. I should have done that. Well, it's tough, but you didn't. But who knows what surprises there are in tomorrow? Life is a picnic and you can make some mistakes. Nobody said you were perfect. It might even be more interesting. You burned the dinner, so you go out. <laughs> My final thought, count your life by smiles, not by tears. Count your age by friends, not years. Many things will catch your eye, but only a few will catch your heart. Pursue those. Gotta go feed the pups. So I'll see you next week, friends. You can reach me on Twitter at John Willard 47 Until then, this is John Willard from the farm.